Uh, greetings, my friends. Glad to see you all. Glad you're here. And uh, yes, that's uh, you know we're gonna we're gonna get this poem out. I'm excited because it was it is shorter than the last few, and uh, I had trouble getting through them. My God, I wouldn't be very good at reciting these in front of people. I'm like messing up all the time. It's uh, I mean I've got the words right in front of us on this teleprompter thing, but still you just mess up, and, and sometimes when you if you once you've done it a few times, you've messed up. You're just waiting, you know, and then as it gets further down, you're just like. A bit of tongue tied or something, um, but yeah. Anyhow, uh, I hope you I hope you enjoy these things. Again, I'm. Uh, it's nearly the end of February, actually. At uh, at this at this point, what is it today? It's the twenty seventh, I think. Um, and I'm going to start from the first. I want to start doing some live streaming of uh, not poem reciting because I messed that up. I'm going to. Uh, well, actually, I might do that. Do you know I'm not going to be bothered about. If I mess up, I mess up. If I mess up, I mess up. It's like if he dies, he dies. A bit of a dolphin. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do some some workouts. I'm looking over here. I know you can't see, but uh, let me pull up. But I'm gonna I'm gonna do a 30 day challenge uh, of uh, just it's just like 300 reps. It's not you know it's not it's nothing extreme. You know, um, people work out every day, uh, but it's just something to do. Uh, like 100 pull ups, 100 dips, 100 sit ups for 30 days in a row, uh, just consistent with them and then uh, adding maybe a weight vest. I don't know why I'm telling you these, um, sorry this is like the poem one, but I'm just, you know, you know me, I kind of, if you've watched any of these before, you know that I'm, I'm like flubber, flubber man, I'm just like off on a tangent. But uh, yeah, so, I'm, you know, I'm excited about trying to do it live, so I need to set up another, a different Facebook account, because uh, I want to have one that's kind of with all the creative stuff and workouts and that. So, uh, but yeah, you know, if, if well, actually, I was about to say if you want to join this, you, you probably won't see this one until I'm into it. But anyhow, I'll be doing other ones in the future, you know. But uh, for you know, I have to warn you that the top is off, but the, the bottoms are there. Don't worry about it. <laughs> There's, um, you know, I'm keeping my uh, my dignity. But yeah, just so anyhow. Okay, I want to crack on with this poem. And this one is called, uh, let me recall it because it doesn't say it on the screen there, and I think it is called Eternal Solace. Yes, Eternal Solace. In the vastness of the void's expanse, at the heart of each and every core, in the centre of our Milky Way, there lays a beast that gorges more. It has no heart or mercy, it just consumes the souls who stray into the web of all destruction devouring all its prey. Its tendrils stretch through time and space to latch onto the ones who dare, who enter into demon's den, transfixed with now eternal stare. And once the grip has taken hold, nothing that has ever lived can snap the bonds that hold them. So forever they are sieved, dissected beyond their atoms, crushed beyond what's known, into the fields of solace, their remains are cast and sown. Yeah, that's uh, it's a bit shorter, you know, but which is good. You know, I'm, some, some are short and some are long, some are intermediate. I don't know. But I was uh, watching a program, I've been reading more books on, on physics and quantum worlds, and reading this one by Brian Greene now called The Elegant Universe, which uh, I feel like I'm grasping a little bit more. I mean, I don't understand, don't get us wrong, I don't understand this stuff, but. I've read through many of these things and I've forgotten most of it. And I just kind of want to start to try and know something a bit deeper. I'm not talking about learning all the formulas and things, just conceptually, yeah, that's the right way to say it. Understanding what's going on in, well, if that's even reality is how it perceives to be. And there's no guarantee that it is because, you know, if we're just vessels, if we do indeed have brains, and I'm not, I know people are like, what are you talking about? But, you know, there's all kinds of theories out there. You know, that um, that we could just be balsam brains, I think. Maybe that just float through the universe and we're just creating realities. But, but in a way, we do just create realities because if things are how they appear to be, then I guess imagery comes in through light into the brain and the brain's just deciphering it and then just shoving it out in what it's capable of doing. So reality won't be what we see exactly. You know, although you know, we touch things and they're there and, you know, but I don't know, it's um, it's got to be different, you know, and then, um, 
than what we can really see. And obviously, we can only see on a very small, uh, visible spectrum within there, and it's like much faster. So it'd be cooler to, um, to like chuck in a pair of universe eyes. That'd be pretty cool. A bit like uh, if you ever seen the film Lucy. That's like I love that film. That was pretty cool when she was advancing through a bit. No, it does spoil it, it's like, but not really. But then you know, as she could start seeing the the quantum threads or whatever, and just tweaking things and that. It's just uh, yeah, yeah. I'll say no more on that. Don't want to swear things. Okay, my friends. Till tomorrow. Uh, I'll bid you adieu. If that's <laughs> I don't know, that's probably right or wrong. No. Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> See you tomorrow. <laughs> Greetings, my friends. Thank you for watching whatever it was you just watched. I hope it's left you confused or uh, excited or inspired or whatever emotions is running through your head right now. I appreciate it. But please hit the thumbs up and uh, pass things on to your friends if you think they need to watch this. And uh, if you'd like to look at any of my art or purchase any of my art, then please check out the links below for the website, um, Instagram, Facebook, and all that jazz. Uh, take care. I shall see you soon. Thanks. Bye.